Evil must be destroyed. Before you die, allow me to show you the might of the Tuffles! Curse that purple-skinned mortal. How dare he steal my body? A god's body. That technique is a strange one. I will hunt him down and punish him for this sin. Huh. But that will prove difficult in this body. This is blasphemy of the highest order. Before anything, I must first reclaim my most noble and holy body. I finally found you. Did you really think you could escape me? You there. I don't know who you are, but if you intend to defend Captain Ginyu, I will show no mercy. And if you're indeed aware of this little situation, then your extermination is required. And who are you? Oh! You have business with this body's owner. <laughs> My, you're awfully pompous. Are you pretending to be someone else? Your stubbornness is unforgivable. You still intend to resist, do you? How foolish. You of all people should know you are immensely outclassed here. You seem rather spiteful for this body's owner. Yet. Did he use me to escape this tyrant? That mortal has committed the ultimate sin. <laughs> this insufferable humiliation will not go unpunished. <laughs> I'm struggling against Captain Ginyu. Impossible. <laughs> you can't be Captain Ginyu. Ginyu. Ah. So that is the name of the robbed me of my divine body. I am the most splendid and undying god, Zabas. Do not mistake me, Red Wolf in Your name is Zamas. Well, it seems you truly aren't Captain Ginyu, then. Did I not mention before that were I in my own rightful body, I would suffer no mortals? But it was a mortal who put you in this mess, was it not? I say you've suffered already. Oh, Tom. This body is all I need to put you in your place. <laughs> You've mustered quite an impressive performance in an unfamiliar body. Perhaps we could join forces, hmm? As you are aware, I have unfinished business with Captain Ginyu. Something for which he must be punished. You. Want to find him as soon as possible, yes? With my men at your disposal, that should be no problem. You expect me to work in tandem with you? Absurd. But in this body... Very well. I will cooperate with you until we find the more. But do not mistake this for companionship. It seems we've reached an agreement. I, too, am not looking to make this permanent, so that is ideal. What? Oh my, what unfortunate timing. I suppose it can't be helped. We'll have to stop rolling. Do not give me look, as if you aim to command me to assist you. Do you want to learn Captain Ginyu's whereabouts, or shall I leave you to your own devices? You mock me with your terrible Once in my right big body, I will make you suffer. This body is a prison. This battle would have ended long ago were I in my own. Such 
confidence with Broly as your opponent. I highly doubt your own body would be enough. <laughs> It seems he's finally been quelled. He is a rather cumbersome one to handle. He was but a beast, bereft of any shred of intelligence. These savages waste my time. Freezer! I hear your insert of Ginyu. It's as you've heard. And what of it? Don't play dumb with me. It seems that you're weakest to an inferior being. What is that photograph? Brother, I will not hear another word of this. If you continue this nonsense, you will pay dearly. Watch your tone. You are in disgrace to our clan. You will pay for your failures with your life. Am I to be audience to a trifling sibling rivalry? Preposterous. If I were in my own body, I'd be spared. Before you atone for your sins against our clan, I will pity you and help you eradicate him. Now you act like that. How convenient. I will see to Captain Junior's punishment myself. How much longer will this squabbling continue? They waste the time of a god. <sighs> Finally it ends. This body shackles me. You will not burden me with more distractions like this. This was none of your concern, and do not speak of my little issue here again. Finding Captain Ginyu, that is the sole purpose of our alliance. You disgrace me with your vile disposition. You will regret this insolence in due time. So then... <laughs> I've been looking for you, Captain Ginyu. Lord Frieza! You shouldn't have. You won't live to tell about it. But Lord Frieza, I was only... Silence! Mortal. You will soon know what no other as a transgression of inhabiting my almighty body. That is a sin worthy Pathetic. You are beyond unfit to wield a divine body such as mine. It is a form too much for the mortal soul. Only I have it. Are you quite finished conversing with yourself? I intend to make this quick. Try to keep up. You that this is taking so long. <laughs> <laughs> you will not escape your punishment. I will reclaim my body here and now. <laughs> Ch change! Your final moments are upon you, Captain Ginyu. You must pay for your crimes. You know that, don't you? You... You've got it all wrong! I... I only wanted others to see how glorious your pose was, Lord Frieza! Shut your mouth! What are you talking about, pose? I was admiring my physique in the mirror! Uh, oh no! What is this photograph? What an unsightly form! So this is what the cause of all this trouble has been? What did you say? Unsightly? How dare you! I intended to keep my training efforts a secret!
You selfishly expose someone's secret and mock him! Unforgivable! I will leave no trace of you! You squabbled over insignificant mortal matters and drew me, a god, into this conflict. <laughs> a third! Oh, this is only further to more sun world with their existence. My purpose is all too clear. Rejoice, for I will absolve you of your sins by absolving you of this. The only one dying here is you! I don't care if you're a god! You will get no mercy from me! fate of those who defy the gods. Mortals are steeped in sin and must be cleansed. But in honor of your service to me, I will allow you to escape with your life. Step but one inch out of line, and you will know my wrath. That's it. Good. Keep concentrating on your... <laughs> 